Hey, what's up? I'm Kristen Apple, and welcome to my vlog. If you're already subscribed, thanks for being Team Apple. You're my bestie. And if you're not subscribed, do it, and then we can be besties too. Today is Thursday, October 26th, which means it's a school day. I have class on Thursday, and lately I've been going for comfortable when I get dressed for school. So, like, for some reason, I just feel like I have outfits that look good, and then I have outfits that are comfortable, but I feel like it's really hard to find an outfit that's both. So for me, comfortable is like a loose t-shirt like this. Oh, I just totally kicked the camera. And then these are just like some loose skinny jeans from Hollister. And then on my feet, these are sneakers. I'm also wearing this jacket from Hollister today. And like, I'm so obsessed with it because it feels amazing. It's like I'm wearing a sleeping bag all day. Also, I wanted a black denim jacket anyway because, you know, then I look edgy and cool. So you're probably asking yourself, Kristen, why are you rambling about comfortable clothes versus cute clothes? It's because I need some support, people. Comment below if you also struggle with this. Hashtag choose comfort. Hashtag frumpy but comfortable. I don't know. Comment something because I think if we can all see that we all sometimes struggle then we'll all feel better. But enough about me and my busload of problems because there is something bigger going on today. Woo! So you may be wondering why there is now an air mattress right in front of our door now. Alexander's sister and her boyfriend are coming in town tonight. I'm so excited. They're coming in from DC, coming here to New York City. So we got an air mattress so they don't sleep on the floor. I'm going to move it, but that will have to wait because right now I have to go to school. Oh. Epic fail. That was I was supposed to roll like a front flip. I don't know what I just kind of thought. I'm home, current song, Feel It Still by Portugal the Man. And I tweeted the line that says, I'm a rebel just for kicks now, and Portugal the Man liked it, so that was pretty cool. Didn't vlog anything while I was at school, but I can update you on my entire day at school in like 10 seconds. I sat and read from this book, did not finish what I was supposed to finish reading. And then I went to class took notes and then when I was leaving school I noticed a banner that said that there's a costume party tonight at school and since our house guests aren't gonna be here apparently for like five hours and Alexander's not home I think I'm gonna go today's the 26th so it's not quite Halloween yet but Alexander and I's costumes arrived. We're doing Riverdale basically. So my Riverdale cheerleader top, I like that. I think that's actually perfect. This is like the Jughead t-shirt that he wears, the character in the show all the time. So yeah, Alexander will wear that. But anyways, it doesn't matter because Alexander's not going with me to this party tonight. Here's my cheerleader skirt. I ordered this just from like a cheerleading site. I don't think it's exactly the same blue as the top, but like I think it'll work. But I don't have the white tights yet, so I think it's time to activate my Halloween contingency plan, which is I, for reasons that remain unknown, just happen to have a Wildcats basketball jersey. This, for those of you who don't know, this is from the movie High School Musical. It says Bolton on the back. I don't have a lot of time to like get ready, and I want to save like my good costume for actual Halloween, I think, for tonight. Just gonna throw on the jersey. I got my costume on, wearing struggle jersey with jeans and white high top vans. So I'm gonna be Troy Bolton from that one scene, that one time. 
that he wears a jersey with jeans. I know what you're thinking. It's crazy how much I look like Troy Bolton. So I'm about to leave for the party, but real quick, I was going to show you guys an update on preparing for house guests. This is like basic attempts at adulting. That's the trash that I got to take out. That won't be here when they get here, but yeah, I put the only bedding I could find on the bed. I couldn't find like a fitted sheet to put on their mattress, but I had this blanket that was big enough to cover the mattress. And then I got packaging tape. So I taped each of the four corners of the blanket to the bed. Okay, Kristen, time to go eat food and a room full of strangers for a good cause. Okay, I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm here. The DJ seems cool, and there's actually a lot of people here, and everyone's wearing costumes, so this is fun. I'm glad I came. I will probably see you guys after, though, because it's too loud to vlog. Hey, guys. So Alexander and I just got back from the Halloween party. He came and met me while I was there, so I was really excited. And then when we got back to our place, we had guests. So this is Alexander's sister. What's your name? Joanna. And this is her boyfriend. Jeff. And I'm very excited that they're in town because they're a lot of fun. And we're gonna like, I don't know, do uh -huh. stuff, hang out for the weekend. Yeah? Yeah. Where are you guys in town from? DC. DC, yeah. So I'm gonna lose this uh, Troy Bolton jersey now and go hang out with them. So I'll sign off, find something, anything to smile about for yourself. Love yourself, I'll dinner. Do you want to say the last part? And find something to be happy about. No, just say I'll see you soon. Oh, I'll see you soon too. <laughs> and we'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, seriously, this, this is a hazard. We would be negligent to leave this here. Alright, is everyone camera ready? <laughs> as ready as I'll be.